show you my favorite drugstore items and recommendations for somebody that's first starting off with makeup. So I'm going to show you some of my favorites right now and I'm going to start off with brushes. So I have two different um, brush brands that I really like from the drugstore. Um, one brush brand can be found at Ulta, which is sort of like a drugstore in a way since it is divided the store and one side of the store has all drugstore products and the other has more high-end products. So in the drugstore side of the store, they have a brand called Real Techniques and their brushes are absolutely amazing. I have about three different sets of them so far and I really want to get all of the brushes in the entire collection because I love them that much. Now they have all synthetic hair and the one that I'm showing you right now is the buffing brush but Real Techniques has a lot of different brushes to choose from um, so I'm just showing you one right now. This is what they look like. They have different color handles and the brushes are just so soft so I definitely recommend Real Technique brushes. Another brand that is great from the drugstore is EcoTools. Now you can find EcoTools basically anywhere. And this is just one of the little eyeshadow sets. They have a lot of different um, little sets. But this is great, especially if you're traveling. For eyeshadow products, I have three different neutral palettes that I'm going to show you. The first one is from Hard Candy. It's a duo. And I love their baked eyeshadows. This is in the shade Peace. And they are beautiful. They remind me of the MAC Mineralize um, eyeshadow. So I definitely recommend these. Especially this color. The color piece is absolutely stunning. The second one is Shimmering Sands from CoverGirl. I'm sure that you guys have heard a lot about this palette. It's a beautiful palette. Great quality for the drugstore. Great neutral colors for an everyday look. And then the next one that I absolutely love too is from Wet n Wild. And this is in the palette Walking on Eggshells. Ugh, I can't open it. Okay. Alright. So these are the three shades. For bronzer, I really like the Physicians Formula Bronze Booster. And it doesn't make you look muddy. It just has a nice natural bronze glow to it. And this is one of the lighter bronzers from the drugstore because I am very fair. So some of them make me look like a Noopa Loopa. Just saying. <laughs> but um, this one looks very nice, especially for fair skin. And I really like this one. I think it's very high quality for the price that you're paying with Physicians Formula. For foundation or tinted moisturizer, because this one is very sheer, it's from CoverGirl, it's the Nature Lux Foundation, and my shade is 305 Alabaster, and I really like the finish of this, it gives a nice natural look. For a pencil liner, the Physicians Formula pencil liners are great as well. You actually get three different eye liner colors in a pack, so it's a three pack but you're paying one price. I believe these are around $10, but like I said, you get three in a pack. They're very, very creamy. Um, the consistency is great. They stay on your eye all day. They don't smudge or budge, and I really like these. And then for liquid aligner, I seriously love this liquid liner. And I've actually had this one for a very long time, and it hasn't dried out on me, which is kind of crazy. And it's the L'Oreal Paris Carbon Black Linear Intense Felt Tip Liquid Eyeliner. And this is very black. It makes such a precise line because it does have that felt tip applicator. So it makes it very easy to use. And I definitely recommend this. Two mascaras that I have been using recently. And I've been loving these for a very long time. Another mascara that I really like too from the drugstore is... CoverGirl Lash Blast Mascara. That's like one of my all-time faves. I don't have it right now to show you. So I'm going to be showing you the Rimmel London Sexy Curves Mascara. This is amazing. And I really like this. The brush is very cool. It's a cool applicator. It makes my lashes very elongated and it separates them. I do not like really liquefied mascaras. That one has just the right consistency. And then the one from Physicians Formula. Sorry, I, I'm just realizing that I'm showing you a lot of Physicians Formula products, but I really like that brand. 
And this is the Organic Wear Mascara. This tube is seriously one of the coolest mascara tubes that I have ever seen. It is just really cool. And the applicator actually reminds me of the Lash Blast Mascara. Very, very similar. So that's probably why I like this one so much because it's very similar. A drugstore product that I like for my eyebrows is from Wet n Wild. This is seriously a dollar. This is a good pencil if you have blonde hair. And um, I really like this shade. It's in the shade Tube from Wet n Wild. A highlighter slash eyeshadow because you can kind of use this product as an eyeshadow too, but it's meant to be a highlighter. It's from Physicians Formula. It's the Shimmer Strips Vegas Strip the Light Bronzer. And it has different shades Oops. and you're just supposed to swirl your brush in and pick up every shade and no matter what shade you pick it just looks gorgeous on top of your cheekbones I really love this it just gives your cheeks a very nice glow to them and this is also great to just use as an eyeshadow too for a concealer from the drugstore, I've tried a lot from the drugstore. A lot of them crease on me, especially since I have oily skin to top it off. So I really, really love this one from Maybelline. It's the Instant Age Rewind Eraser Dark Circles um, Treatment Concealer. And this works so great. Um, the applicator is nice too. It's like a little sponge applicator. You just dab it on and rub it in. And this actually lasts a pretty long time as well. And I am in the shade 10 Fair. For a powder or a powder foundation, depending on the way that you apply this, it's from Physicians Formula. It's the Mineral Wear Talc Free Mineral Airbrushing Loose Powder in Translucent Light. It actually comes with a little kabuki. This gets very, very messy when you apply it. But it gives such a great coverage and it gives a nice medium to full coverage too if you use a little kabuki with it. And I definitely recommend this if you're looking for more of like a powder foundation from the drugstore. For lips, I actually have a lot of different lip products to show you. So first I'm going to start off with the brand Revlon. They have actually stepped up their game and I really enjoy a lot of their lip products. This first one, I'm not really sure what it's called, but the tube looks like this. Let me see if it says it on here. It says Super Lustrous 20 Pink Afterglow. And the formula of this lip gloss is great. It's not sticky at all. It stays on for a very long time. And the color is just gorgeous. So the, this Revlon lip gloss I absolutely love. Another lip gloss from Revlon that is awesome is this one. I'm not sure what it's called oh it's a Revlon color burst it's in the number eight and it smells really good it kind of has a vanilla scent to it and this next one is a lip butter from Revlon this is my favorite color out of the whole lip butter line and it's in the shade cotton candy 45 and this one kind of had an accident it kind of melted so I don't have too much left but this is the color of it. It's just a really nice pink with a little bit of golden shimmer undertone. I really like the way that this looks on my lips. But this one's like mush, so I have to get another one because I really like that one. And for another brand that I really like is NYX. So you can get the NYX um, products from Ulta. And this is in the shade Sugar Pie. And it's their Mega Shine Lip Gloss. This is a perfect nude color that I absolutely love from the drugstore. Um, it's kind of hard to find some nice nude shades, and this one's really nice. So check this one. It's in Sugar Pie, and I like it a lot. And for another lipstick, this is from Rummel London, and it's in the shade Pink Blush. It's the perfect Barbie pink. This is actually a dupe for the Lady Gaga MAC Lipstick. And the last product that I have to show you today is a blush. This is from Physicians Formula, and it's like their Happy Booster blush. And it has all these little hearts on it, and it makes such a gorgeous pink shade on your cheeks. I absolutely love this blush, and I use this one all the time. So, it's gorgeous. Thank you all so much for watching my video, and I will see you all in my next one. Bye!